And so for only the second time this season, City are at the Etihad Stadium, where they welcome Brentford as they attempt to consolidate their early leadership of the Premier League table. Well, we're just going to pause for a few moments because, of course, it's the first game that we've had here at the Etihad Stadium since the sad news of the passing away of Sven Joran Eriksson. And we'll now have a moment's applause in honour of the former City boss. Well, there aren't many teams who can boast a victory here at the Etihad Stadium. They didn't do it last season, but when they did in November of 2022, Brentford sent City off to the Qatar World Cup. With a feeling of bitter disappointment. The irony is nobody has beaten City here since, although Brentford have started and they've scored. And it's in the back of the City net already through Johan Wisser. The ball came into the box. There was just a moment's hesitation and suddenly it popped in the air and Johan Wisser headed Brentford in front. Remarkable, Ali. I think it's about 20 seconds. You know, it's a long punt from the keeper and City never got a touch on the ball before it ended up in the net. It's just, it's just a hopeful cross to the far post. Lewis Potter arrives, we just see it here now. It was just all too easy. What I will say, it gives us a long time to get back into it, but what a bad start. And Johan Wisser gets his third Premier League goal of the season. City cannot quite believe what's happening here. The eighth minute, Brentford have been the better team by far. Coming again down to City's final third, the Blues just haven't really got going. The ball is with Damsgaard. On it goes down the right side. Across is deflected out for the game's first corner. Andy Morrison, this is yeah, well, brilliant from Brentford. They're just moving the ball, and City aren't sure at the moment who's responsible for each player, Ali. Well, we know that Brentford have a terrific threat from set piece. So many tall players in and around the City penalty area. The cross, oh, it's saved by Edison on the line. It could easily have been two. Edison reacted superbly on the line and turned it away. Otherwise, Brentford would have been 2-0 up. I think it's De Bruyne in the first zone. Doesn't quite get to the ball. And it's good reactions, yeah. It's no fluke that they lead here, is it, Andy? City have won the ball back though, they've got it with Kovacic and on to De Bruyne and back to Kovacic. Kovacic pops it out towards Grealish. Grealish plays it in field to Kovacic. Kovacic 35 metres from goal. On towards Walker. Walker on the edge, plays it to De Bruyne. De Bruyne on towards Haaland. Haaland scores! Erling Haaland with the right foot. It took a deflection on the way through and fizzed into the back of the net. And just in the blink of an eye, City's first attempt on target goes into the back of the net. It is City 1, Brentford 1, and Erling Haaland just his eighth Premier League goal of the season. Yeah, it's, uh, yeah, it's a strange reaction from him as well, quite subdued. Um, it just fell to him, you know, but it fell to the right man at the right moment, and he just swung his right foot at it there. I mean, how many times can it be good fortune, Ali? that you actually find that little pocket of space in the box, but he makes the most of it. It's a huge goal, that, for Manchester City. Walker throws it to De Bruyne. De Bruyne guides it into the middle for a Kanji. A Kanji midway inside the Brentford half. Plays it to Rico Lewis. Lewis inching towards the left side, finds Grealish. Grealish back inside to Lewis again. Lewis helps it on to De Bruyne, shooting position. De Bruyne has it on his left foot, low and just wide. Really nice attempt, it was a daisy cutter with the left foot and it fizzed by the upright. I've not seen a team in many, many seasons in Champions League football as well, Ali, who have done as well as Brentford after, after, after the day. I think it's down to City not um, doing the right things as well as Brentford being very, very good. Well, City are going long and Haaland's through on goal. Haaland, 2-1. Edison with the assist and Haaland did the rest. He muscled Pinnock out of the way and dinked it over the top of the advancing Flecken. It, well, it is the epitome of Route 1 football and City lead by two goals to one. And Erling Haaland has just shown why he's one of the best centre-forwards we have ever seen. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm hoping, Ali, and I, but that there's clever. Now, he's clearly onside, but it's just this little bump here. There, that little bump there was enough. And 
It's very naive from Pinnock. Pinnock has to go. He has to go goal side and safe. But he's tried that, and, and it's just the big man's just exceptional. I mean, it, he is without doubt one of the best centre forwards we have ever seen. And Haaland's on the ball, and he finds Grealish. Grealish! Oh, it's over the bar by Norgard. It was a tap in for Gundogan, but Norgard got there first. And just at the moment, Brentford are rocking, and City are looking for more. Savinho goes back to Walker. Walker in the right wing position to Savinho. Savinho in the right wing position back to Walker. On it goes to Rodri. Rodri on to Grealish. Grealish comes inside, plays it to a Kanji. Kanji to Gvardiol. Gvardiol De Bruyne. He tried to play it back to Gvardiol away by Vandenberg. Picked up by De Bruyne. De Bruyne on to Grealish. Grealish shooting position, tipped away by Flecken. Really lovely play from De Bruyne, and he teed it up for Grealish. Grealish opened up his body, tried to bend it in the corner, and it's a good save by Flecken. Yeah, tremendous save. Just fingertips at full length. Still in the possession of Gavardio, ready to take the throw. Looking around, finds Grealish. Grealish turns, rides a challenge, finds Rodri. Rodri Pops it into the possession of Walker. Walker on the edge of the area. Played it into Gundogan. Gundogan in the penalty area. Haaland, great save, Flecken. Haaland on the first time side foot. And Flecken with the reactions to tip it over for another corner. And deny Haaland another City hat trick. with Gundogan. It's good play by City, they're coming forward, they're darting forward, of all players all the way through is Gvardiol, and he plays it across, and Savinho, good save by Flecken. Well, wonderful burst forward by Gvardiol, and then he teed it up after he was held up, and Savinho couldn't squeeze it through Flecken, but it was great play by Gvardiol down the middle. He gets everything right, and yes, oh, it's just a great toe from Flecken. Akanji into Rodri. Good closing down by Carvalho, but it breaks for Stones. And now Walker out wide to Savinho. Savinho down the right side, taking on Lewis Potter. Still with Savinho, comes inside Savinho, keeps on coming Savinho. Still Savinho! Oh, unlucky! That would have been a special, special goal. This young fella, he is explosive. Yeah, his, his thought is only to get at the fullback. And once he's got him going backwards, that little drop of the shoulder, it's brilliant. Ball is now with Savinho. Savinho inside the penalty area, comes on to his left side, finds Rodri. Rodri to Grealish, Grealish prods it on. De Bruyne in towards Haaland! Oh, he's hit the post. Haaland again! Oh, it's blocked by uh, Collins, it was, who threw his body on the way. Goodness me, Haaland hits the inside of the post, and then his next shot's blocked by Collins. That's, that's four, five, six outstanding saves from Flecken, but so, so easy at this stage of the game now, Ali, to find them little pockets. I mean, that's just Kevin De Bruyne looking up and just sets him up perfect. So, two minutes of added time and we're into the first of them and Haaland's got it and now it's helped on by Rodri and now Savinho Savinho good tackle by Shard who came back at it did well did Shard now it's in the possession of Norgard and Umbomo to the edge of the area Umbomo tries to get beyond a couple of players and the shot comes in it's well wide of the goal and City lead 2-1 So the half-time score has turned out to be the full-time score. Erling Haaland's two goals that turned the match around after Johan Wisser had given Brentford the lead in the first few seconds of the match. City 2, Brentford 1.